We're going to have a look at one of my favorite uses for Syntax Effects Block by setting up a filter to create a phaser effect. What's up everyone, I'm Dave Mack and in this series of tutorials we're going to have a look at creative and interesting ways to use Syntax Effects Block. So let's have a look at how we can set up the filter to create a phaser effect. Simply choose a single or dual notch filter, single or dual, and an LFO to modulate the filter cutoff frequency. So this is where we're gonna modulate this. set up an LFO to modulate the filter frequency on the effects block, like so. I'm going to set this LFO type to dual notch in this case. You will hear what I mean. And change the resonance to taste. Let's make it quite white to make the effect more obvious. Now we get a super hypnotic effect. Now on the track, the audio track itself, we can combine this with another notch filter on the analog voices. We have a notch filter. And use another LFO to modulate that with different speeds. And now we have two phaser effects interweaving with each other to create a super hypnotic kind of effect. On the digital side of things, this to the effects block, this pad that you hear, it's also being phased. And on the digital side we have the EQ, which is basically, we can also set to a notch filter. We can either boost or cut, and if we cut it, we get another phase effect. In this case we have to get rid of one of the LFOs, set this to filter frequency, to create another kind of interweaving phaser effects. Together with what's happening here, you can get some very trippy vibes. I use this trick a lot in my grooves on the Syntax as it creates such an ever-evolving effect that really draws you in. You can learn many additional sound design and groove techniques through my courses and cheat sheets. For example, the Mastering Syntax course bundle will go through all the steps to create a groove from scratch into a full track on Syntax. The course covers all Syntax functions and how to use them effectively and creatively. For more information and free content like cheat sheets, head over to davemacklive shop and become a Syntax master. I hope these tricks inspire you to use the effects block in creative ways. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel and click the bell to be notified when a new video in this effects block series is released. Cheers!